Hey everyone, it's Vian here. Wanted to share with you a couple items I got from Goodwill today. Um, and then a couple items from other times that I've picked up. I kind of cut a collective haul, but most of them are from today. Um, this is a little hobnail uh, milk glass that I got. And I think it's one of my first, yeah, first ones that are um, hobnail. And um, it was... 50% off of $7, so it was for $3.50, so I liked it. There, they, there was another one that was um, taller, and it had a stand, but it was kind of stained right here, like kind of brownish, and it wasn't put 50% off, so I decided not to get it. Um, and then there's this one here. I got this one for $2, so it's kind of cute, kind of like a candy dish. And then I got this one. Um, I'm not sure if this is milk glass or not. It, it just looks kind of vintagey, and it would be good for flowers or whatever in here. So I got it, and it was two fifty. Most of the things I got was fifty percent off. So and then I got this one set of two, um, which I've had for a while. And so I took some of my fans and stuff like that in there for now. But um, I got two of those. And I think they were $5 or something. I can't remember. And then I picked this one up. I'm not sure if I've shown this before, but it has a little, it's like a, it's like a wine. I don't know what this is. Like a wine glass or something? Or for sugar or something like that. And it has a little lid on it. And I believe I got this one for like $3.99, I think. And then I also picked up this little jar. Um, it's kind of cute, and it's pink, so it's just a little something different in the collection, but um, yeah, so that's my little collection so far, and I picked up some yarn because I've been knitting a lot lately. Um, let me get this out of the way. So I got this bag right here, and the color was blue, so blue is 50% off, so I got this whole bag for $2.50. I really like this type of yarn right here. I think it'll make really pretty flowers. Um, and this one as well. And there's like three bowls of this one, so I'll make that. And then this pink one is huge, but we'll see what I'm going to do with that. And then just some random blue ones in there. So it's pretty good for $2.50. And then I picked up this bag right here. I really like this one. And this color is really pretty. And then this is like a thicker um, crocheting. Yeah. And then I got it actually for this as well. Um, these fiber strings right here. I have tons of them already, but I just love putting them in flowers. And then they also have this color, like kind of brownish color. Sorry for the noise, I don't want to take it out. And that's a pretty cool, like black and metallic. Yeah. So, um, yeah, that's all I got, you guys. And then, so I just want to share with you really quick my um, crochet stuff that I've been working on. It's just, I made this little flower here. It's kind of, it looks like it's lopsided because it probably is. I probably screwed up somewhere, but it's my first time making these flowers. So, um, and I had a lot of fun. I'll probably be making more. So there's that one. I understand why it looks kind of lopsided here, <laughs> but yeah. And then I made this one. I really like this one. This one looks really vintage, especially with this um, color of thread. Really like that, how it looked. And, and then I did this flower. This is a really fun and easy flower, but it takes forever. Like, I swear, I, it was never ending trying to make this flower. So, but I like it. And then I also did some butterflies. Um, I watched a tutorial. Somebody, I don't remember who. I'll link her below if I remember if I when I find out who she is. But um, she did, I made this butterfly with her tutorial. But then I thought that the upper is not as big as I would like it. So I kind of tweaked it on my own. And I made these instead. So these ones, the body are a little bit bigger on the top, or the wings. A little bit bigger and I actually like how this one look but my dog chewed it seriously he did chew this up so you guys can see like either he chewed it or my daughter tried to cut it but I believe that my dog chewed it so
so um, I could probably just try and glue that and use it somehow like under something I don't know but yeah so that's just some things that I've been working on with crocheting and I'm gonna be playing more making more and probably making a lot more of these ones as these are so adorable all right you guys that's all thanks for watching and uh, I'll talk to you guys later bye